What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Marky. I'm here with another video. Um, we're going to be doing Talon Jungle analysis here. I decided, why stop at that? just the Ash Support Series analysis for the collaboration videos I'm doing with my good buddy, Kha'Zix Job. I decided I'm going to do other things as well. Now, this game did end in 20 minutes because my team was fed, but... This analysis, I'm going to anal analyze um, an analyze uh, Talon as a jungler to see if he's any good, in my personal opinion. Now this is, I believe, patch 7.7 or 7.8. Correct me if I'm wrong on that. But I decided I was going to do a Talon jungle game to see how well he can do against... Um, See well, see how well he can do against other junglers in this patch. Would be the um, words for it that I would get. Um, Welcome. So we did have our comp Rift. was Annie mid, Timo top, Vayne ADC, Sona support, and me as jungle on Talon. And the other team was had Zaya and Rakan on it. Ha! A Yasuo mid, a Timo top. So it was a mirror, mirror, uh, mirror, ah, mirror fight top, and the least in was the least in was jungle. So it was it was a pretty interesting match to be honest. I did die only one time. But it was, this this, this he did try some pretty cheeky plays because he, he was desperate to get Yasuo, but it just it couldn't it just Minions didn't have spawned. At least I don't think it did. I'm not sure who got first blood, I don't exactly remember. The Sona fucked up her warding there, she accidentally warded that when she should have warded over the wall, but it's My okay. blades will find their way into your heart. So, basically this game, I just went, I didn't even build, hey, I didn't even build a jungle me. item, to be honest. I built Tracker's Knife, and then that's it. So basically my jungle build is this, I, my talent jungle build, I will leave in the description if you'd like, if you'd like to try it out. I did fairly well with this build. I did end up, I ended up like this. So this build kind of works. It kind of doesn't. If you don't get fed, you're pretty much screwed at this point because you don't have any. If you don't get fed on talent, especially in the jungle, in mid lane you can kind of farm up a little bit, but your jungle, if you're jungling with them, your farm is a little bit, your farm is a little bit slower than it normally would be if you're mid laning or top lane. But if you get fed enough. And you get your, and you get two, you get two, two lethality items. You're, you're pretty much set. I will leave my full build, the full build that I had planned on going in the description. I did not get a chance to get full build, but I will leave the full build that I had planned on going into the description. before somebody got first block. I think it was like level 6 or level 5 before somebody got first block. Like everybody on the map was like level 6 or level 5 before somebody got first block. It was a really long first block. I ain't gonna if I remember it. right. Nice to unmeet you. Because I warded and I saw him, like, oh, we'll, we'll be careful, Teemo. So, Lee Sin did try to come top and try to kill our Teemo, but I, I counter-jungled it. Um, I mean, not counter jungle. I counter-gagged it. And stopped him from killing Teemo, so it was it was all good. 
I counter jungled it. Or counter, I counter ganked him. He tried to come in on here. He's like, oh, I'm not gonna get him. I'm just gonna back up. And then Timo, he kept going for Timo. And then I came around the book. I came around the turret. And I was still that. I'm like, you, you come near Timo, and I will get burst you. I will destroy you. You come anywhere near my Timo. Like I, I early game, I was very protected of our Timo because I wanted him to spiral. I wanted him to spiral or snowball, however you want to call it. I wanted him to snowball above the enemy Timo so we could win top lane. Did I gank top lane a lot? Not really, because honestly, our Timo was doing great on his own. Only when Lee Sin appeared top did I ever bother going top to protect our to protect our lane, that to protect top lane. Only when Lee Sin appeared did I ever go anywhere. Lee Sin didn't cover jungle me a lot, but honestly, I got fed, so it literally didn't even matter because I got fed. It didn't even matter. Like I was like, you know what? I got fed. So, I'm fed. Why do I care about my jungle? I just kept going for the Gromp and the Wolves. Like, I, I didn't even want to grab that to Scrub. Because, you know, honestly, if you're Talon Jungle, your main objective is dive the, fuck on, dive the fuck down on somebody, beat the shit out of them, and get the hell out before you die. That's that's basically it. And it's, just, it's actually the same concept as if you were mid lane or top lane, just diving into a team fight. But, a little bit harder. That bush was warded, in case you were wondering, why did I just waste my eat? Yeah, that bush was warded. They knew I was in that bush. They would have collapsed on me if I had stayed there too long. I was going to ward that, but my warding totem was on cooldown. So I stopped, stopped the thing from diving on Teemo. This Lee Sin was so bad. He was like the one of the most predictable Lee Sins I had ever went off against. Like, I have never seen a Lee Sin more predictable than this guy. Like, I have, every single time he ganks, well, not every time, pretty much almost every time he ganks, I was there to counter him. This was the, one of the only times I wasn't there to counter gank Lee Sin. Right here. This was the, one of the only times I wasn't there to counter gank him. No, we lost one that got first blood, but it was a total fluke. Because we still won this, so it was like, it's complete fluke. I fed the Annie, I got fed myself, and it was just GG. Yeah, he wasted his sums for that, so. Not a good trade for him, to be honest. All his sums for Annie. In a situation like that, this game, with a Talon jungle, in my personal opinion, with a Talon jungle, a Teemo, a Sona, and a Bane, wasting your sums like that is not a good idea, because everybody can just collapse on you and you're dead. But, we... Fortunately for the Yasuo, nobody was around to collapse on him and kill him, so. We also, I believe we did get first turret bot lane. I don't think first turret bot lane is relevant, but we did get first turret, so that's good. Um, yeah. This Lee Sid missed a lot of cues. Risky dragons, by the way. It was like, oh my! The some of the dragons that we got, we really shouldn't have got. I think it was like a two dragon game, and we really shouldn't have got either one of the dragons. But we somehow managed to pull it off. It, it was nuts. It was, it was literally nuts. We somehow managed to pull it off. Lee Sin wanted that dragon. He wanted that dragon so bad, and you know, they didn't get it. So I think it was a three, it was a three dragon game. They got the first dragon, we got the second dragon, and the third dragon. Could I have counter jungled that dragon? Oh no, yeah. Did I want to die to the least in the con? No. So did I do it? No, I let them have the three dragon. Was it a good idea? Probably not. Did it matter? No. We still won. Blue team slain the dragon. So I didn't get my jungle sword. I didn't start building my jungle sword till third item. Because mainly you're not, like, if I'm, I figured I'll just go get my couple of lethality items first and then go for the, then go for the tracker's knife. Can you go red smite on Talon jungle? Yeah. I mean, but for a situation where I'm going against a Lee Sin that's counter jungling me really bad, I figured I might as well at some point just get a tracker's knife and use that to, use that to be able to track Lee Sin. And find out where the fuck he is at all times. So that's what I was doing. That's what I did. This Lee Sin was so bad. 
You're enough. <laughs> That's what I thought when I did that. And I stopped him from killing. I stopped him from. I stopped them from killing Annie. I was like, I will protect this Annie because this Annie late game, mid late is our only hope. Was our, in my personal opinion, our only hope. So I was like, I'll protect this Annie with my, with my, with my last breath. And that's what I did. Watch this shit get spun right here. They decided. They, they decide they want to just dive me. This. The play, the outplayed flash, the dive in. Now watch this. Flash, Tibbers. Bye. Double kill. Get out of here. You're garbage. Completely worth it. And that was the only time I died this whole game. and wolves here. That's that was my main farm here was the, from the of the wolves. This was my main source of farm because Lee Sin kind of just took everything else. But it, it ended up in the, in the end. It ended up being it ended up being so it was like I mean I did get I did get raptors here one time. This is the one time I did get raptors. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Bang was asking for assistance and nobody was responding because we had to open the mid. We had to wait for that. We had to wait for Annie before we could go in. Off the near me I was not afraid to die because Annie was protecting me just as I had protected her. She was like, if Talon's gonna protect me, I'm gonna protect her. No matter how, or protect if Talon, I say, say Talon was like Annie was like if Talon's gonna protect me, I'm going to protect him. That's that was her mindset. Like every time I went near her, I got I either got a kill and got out or gave her a kill. It was it was the combo between the combo synergy between me and this Annie this game was literally disgusting. I have never seen a combo synergy more perfect than this between me and this Annie here. This was Blue team's the, our combo synergy was literally disgusting. And like I said, we did get first turn. I thought we got first turn. Oh. Like the combo synergy between me and this Annie was it was just legitimately disgusting. Like, oh, it was, it was, it was 100% complete. <laughs> Got him. I thanked Annie for that because I knew it was a kill steal. So I thanked her for that. I said, thanks, Annie. I love you. Because, I mean, I know, I know for 100% fact that that was a kill steal. And it was not my, it was not my place to take that. But I was like, thanks, Annie. I was, I, I thanked her for it because I knew it was a kill steal. I, I knew it. I knew 100% that that was a kill steal. So I just thanked her. I'm like, thanks, Annie. I appreciate it. You know, you're awesome. You know, give me that kill. Like that. I mean, she didn't even need to give me that kill. She could have just took it for herself. But she saw me coming in and she's like, oh, I'll just give Talon this one. Because, he, I mean, she figured, hey, he did give me a double kill early game. 
sacrificing his life for me. So she thought, okay, I'm guessing at this point she thought, hey, I'll just take this double. I'll just give Talon this kill. He deserves it. He sacrificed himself for me. Now here, I did stop because Annie did ask for uh, loot. I told her all yours, so I should take it. You know, you can have loot. It's 100% yours. You earned it. You helped me out a lot. And then watch this. You said, garbage. Get out of here. You're garbage. Get out of here. Like, get, get out of here. He's so ridiculous. Like, you're garbage, Lee Sin. Go home. Get, get, get out of here. You're just garbage. Go home. Just go home, Lee Sin. Go home. You're drunk. Go home. You're drunk as hell. Go home, Lee Sin. You're drunk. And, um, here I did- that- that kill actually did get me my new Moose Ghost Blade. Well, my first item being the new Moose Ghost Blade. Um... Here's a- we had a lot of plays around. We had two or three good plays around this drag. <laughs> we had wards all over their jungle. It was so bad. Almost every single time. Bye. garbage. Bye, Yasuo. I just decided to back up and let Lisa in recall. Because I got the, um, because our soda had Windspeaker's Blessing and I had, I had, like, a two-second shield, so I was like, okay, I'll just, I'll take that, I'll take that two-second shield and kill Our Teemo did lose to the enemy Teemo there, um, it wasn't really good. And then it was like, we was like, I was low on health, but we had, we had Sona, we, I had Sona with me, so I was like, okay, they said tried to steal this track like three times. He tried to go in and steal this track like three times. Got him. And we killed Lisa. I didn't get an assist on Lisa. I, I, didn't, I didn't want to risk him killing me, so I was just like, I'll back up. I decided I'll just, take, I'll just take my good buddy Gronk here. I mean, I'm low on health, but I have I have the I have the hunter's machete, so I, I have I've got enough life seal to take him on. He's low, low, so I was like, yeah, let's go. Let's just take on my buddy Gronk here. Shut down. Ha! Yasuo flash gone. You're drunk. Go home. 
kills this game and I think I ended up with like 10 kills to 10 or 11 kills this game likely 10 synergy was so good, our combo synergy was so good, that if me and Annie wanted the 2v3, we could totally handle it. Did we want to there? No, we didn't, because we didn't want to risk it. We knew we could, but we didn't want to risk it. I did waste my ult again here, trying to go to assist on the awesome one, but Annie was the favorite was quicker on the draw than I was with my ult.
and then they're going to be surrounded. Legend, still legendary. The Lee Sin, the whole time, I had 10 kills. The Lee Sin, the whole time, was like, I said, still le I said, I'm legendary, boys. Lee Sin was like, Lee Sin was like, it's not for long. And I'm like, nope, still legendary. So, is Talon Jungle a viable thing this patch? In my personal opinion, in all honest, in all honesty, it does depend on how how fed you get and how 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 well you are able to one v one the enemy jungler. If in a situation comes that you have to one v one him, um, but exclusion of one v ones in the jungle, team fight potential, uh, exclusion of one v ones, and putting in team fights into the equation. Um, being able to burst down the squishies and from the jungle, just coming out of nowhere from the jungle, just being able to burst down the squishies. Yeah, Talon Jungle does work this patch, in my personal opinion. Yes, it does work. But as I said before, it does depend on how fed you get. And it also depends on your 1v1 potential if you do have to end up 1v1ing the enemy jungler. So, yeah, it's definitely, definitely good. So, um, if you like this video, be sure to leave a like. And subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And I will see you in the next video.